discussions with me. They can be live if you're local Los Angeles area or wherever I am when I'm traveling, but most are done by um, Zoom or Skype or WhatsApp or phone or whatever you're most comfortable with. A session's gonna kind of consist of whatever spirit needs. You kind of tell me what you're looking for. Um, maybe it's why you always pick the wrong spouse or it's a health reading or it's career reading. I usually combine everything. I don't say now it's gonna be mediumship and now it's gonna be psychic work and now it's gonna be divination. I combine everything to get to where you need to get. I see energy, I see the blocks in people, I see the cords connecting us. You know, we use that terminology, cut the cords, no strings attached. Guess what, we've got cords, we've got strings. So sometimes those strings are, are holding us back and sometimes those strings can help us go forward. So when we start a session, um, I'm working with your spirit, I'm working with my spirit, with guides, with deities. I will work often with tarot cards. Now tarot cards are just a tool to work. Um, they have things on them, <laughs> they have little cards on them which we deal with, oh, this is matters of the heart, this is materialistic guilt, this is thought patterns. Um, I use them kind of half by the book and half by intuition because spirit tells me what they mean. Even if somebody says the four of swords is supposed to mean this, maybe in my reading it means that. And that's what an intuitive reader is. So we work with tarot cards. I'm also known for my dowsing rods. If you have some basic yes, no questions, um, that's a very bent one. <laughs> Energy is funny. They cross on yes and they don't cross on no. I am wearing black today. Yes, I am. I am wearing Easter Bunny ears. No, I'm not. Now, I have a ghost over here to my left. Point at Adrian, my spirit friend. That's how they work. You know, whether we're video or not, it just gives you a real fast, easy thing. But often I might be channeling or working with spirit. So my goal in a session is for you to have real positive working information for you to go forward. I just want to tell you this is this and this is bad and this is why you picked the wrong person or the wrong this or this is why you have this issue in your life. I want to say this is why and this is how you can fix it. I want it to be forward movement. So after a session, I'm, I'm always honest, but I'm always positive and forward moving. Again, this is how you cross that river. Get a boat. You know, you get across it. You, you, you keep trying to swim and you don't know how to swim. Get a boat. <laughs> so you will leave a session, whether it's virtual or whether it's live or we're sitting at this dining room table with an understanding of why, whether it's from past lives, whether it's from your childhood. I'm really good at seeing where we put up blocks. Ooh, what happened to you at 12? And you'll go, oh yeah. But you'll go away with real answers and real solutions for you to take care of. No upsell, no you have a demon attached. You don't. I'm not going to try to sell you 14 more sessions because you have a kindly curse. You don't. And if anybody tells you you do, walk away. And if anybody tries to rule you by fear or control, walk away. A good psychic, a good medium, a good coach, a good healer is going to leave you feeling empowered and knowing how to take care of yourself along the way. That's it.